from like from like like almost like um like like the lever arm here of like the exponential for learning is um we we need to be able to put robots out in high volumes and they need to be consistently continuously learning and getting better um we, we are we are seeing that here now we're, we're seeing the robots get better at things they're doing like the more data more training they have things like this we also are seeing the robots just improving as they're doing things in 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 the real world as well those are the things that you really you really want to put a fleet of physical agents out to the world and you want them just by um interacting with the world, getting smarter about how to accomplish these use case and tasks and behaviors. So um, I do think that is is happening now. And I do think we'll see that in the coming one or two years of putting robots out to a fleet of robots out to the world. And um, the the use cases the robots are doing are actually getting better daily. And the robots are almost using these like model traces as a way to put back into pre-training for the rest of the fleet. So um, uh, that that's a, that's a similar thing. That, that's basically the ultimate like uh, moat here is you want to get a fleet of robots out to market that are both getting cheaper with scaled manufacturing, and they're getting smarter, and they're they're collectively sharing that with the rest of the fleet.